This is doing the stencil part one. By Chris Gurman. We gather here today to talk about stencils and how I plug it and why I actually have to use them or actually the way I do them. One of them has to be very useful. I usually work with the uh, 05 uh, ball pen, uh, ball pen, ball pen, and ball pen, pen. Jesus, let's figure English together. Ball pen, pen. Yeah, I usually work with ball pen, pen. So now he couldn't get it through. It's 05. Yeah, zero five that yeah. region. So my stencil, yeah, the rotary one, are pretty accurate. I try to make them accurate according to. For the portrait, I do use uh, paper, usually for something very detailed, but I try to use it digitally. And I do have a video. You can go and check it out. It's how I use the printer PJ from Brother. It's exactly a similar one. I'm pretty bad at making the audio for the video as that. So it's hard to get it. But they flick those pictures like yeah, these are like oh, somebody's in the same like I think. But that was made for myself. But, but. On the printer settings, always look for the oh, try to accurate map. Everything I do take it important for me. The nail, shadows, and I don't know what's right or wrong or which having too many or too less, I think. So this is the first part of the production for a, a full movie. I think stencil they are like marks on life. This, some of them can be accurate, some of them can be freehand. Some of them can be part for a guy to use different rules. Depends the way you understand it, I could say. Probably, yeah, probably the way you understand it. Capital letter. Oh, I shouldn't use the bad language. But, uh, <clears throat> bad language is bad. And on here. Uh, I don't know if it's recording or not, or if it's actually. Through recording through whatever I see when I'm clicking those pages like I don't want to be. Use stencil stuff. Use stencils. I mean, I, I'm not sorry. Don't, don't use anything you want. I mean, no, use everything you want or anything you want or how it works. My English gets worse again. I use stencil stuff as I know it's reliable. I wash with alcohol, the skin, of course, before I start applying the stencil. Usually, I I mean, generally, always, I do shave it as green salt. Shave it nice and slowly, then wash with alcohol. If you wash with alcohol, it cleans the grease and open the pores. When you put the stencil, make sure, I mean, at least if you do it by hand and uh, you use the stencil stuff, I do find out that it's very hard to wash it off. So I use alcohol. I use alcohol to wash it off too. I don't really let it dry for too long. If you let it dry for more than 15 minutes, it'd be extremely hard to wash it off and that type of session will be gone down to the drain. I do have a video up if you check it. Go back on my videos, check it out, and subscribe if you want to be part of whatever I post. I try to post more often when I can. But you do can actually subscribe the thing and make take a shot again. I do have a video. I do have a video, it's on YouTube, it's all about how I apply the stencil, how I make the stencil. Actually, I have a lot of videos. I do have a lot of videos on YouTube, that's where we will have to fucking check it out sometimes. I try to push. So, for all making stencil, it's how you see it, but I do think it's important. Again. Three hand tattoos, the extra mega tool was super amazing as any other tattoo. I don't think there's a rule for anything or any kind of tattoo or any kind of stuff there. It depends on everyone's skills and everyone's knowledge how to use their skills. So pretty much. Who knows? I do. It may sound confusing, but in my head, it's embossed. As, as I do hyper realism, let's say, 
on, on my case, my general case, as I don't have a rallies, then of course I somehow try to map everything I can see. Or I think I should apply somehow. I mean, there's, you can mimic seven, uh, gray, seven shades of gray. Yes, yes. But, yes, you can achieve them. Um, mimic them. So you're gonna map something you think you're gonna see. Again, there's no rules. What's a lot, what's not enough, it's how much you really, it's, it's somehow like um, playing by numbers. And I can see how and why I buy a lunatic. I need not to do this. So whatever works for you, doesn't matter. It's not too much, it's not enough. Not enough, not too many. I think there's nothing to learn about. I mean, I choose to make a video about these particular pictures because I do have a video coming, how I made it. It's gonna be a full-time video, it's on fake skin. It's pretty close up, I use different type of lenses. And, uh, yeah, right. You use the filter for lenses. <laughs> I have to mention, but I mean, I plan to fill this video up, of course. I said, of course, too much, of course. No, um, of course, I didn't say, of course. Anyway, yeah. Check my next video, or check my last video, or the one. Check my next video, basically, it's exactly what we're talking right now about this piece of tattoo. I'm gonna put it on, I put it on fake skin, it's not that gonna. No, I said I put it on. Just check it out, check it out, check it out, don't worry. <laughs> don't worry, be happy, don't worry. <laughs> don't worry, be happy, don't worry. <laughs> that could be a hip hop, but I mean just hip hop. T club. My English could be way better if I tried. What happens if I don't try? Don't even tell me everything right now.